I guess I'm the old trapper and I'm gonna take that thing I'm I'm new to this my grandkids and my son want me to get on YouTube because I've trapped all my life we we got a few uh, ways of doing some things that other people don't we're getting ready now and uh, we just changed oil in the four-wheeler we're gonna load the pickup up we are we think we're about four or five days away from starting on the beaver I use a lot of wire and heavy weights and, and drowning rods this summer we're gonna have some uh, food plot plantings and then uh, a lot of raccoons <laughs> and skunks this summer I'm getting some traps ready for a guy those are all rubber jaws that I used when I was in the live fox market uh, we got a few conibears ready to go got a few beaver traps ready to go and uh, my old skin and shed went bad so we burned her down and I moved into my meat cutting room which is now my skinning shed and uh, this summer we'll be doing a lot of raccoon and skunks in people's yards and in their sweet corn patches and then I'm going through my uh, one and a halfs they're in terrible shape I used them a lot and just put them away wet so yeah, we didn't get a hundred coyotes this year because they're not worth much and uh, but we'll keep trying to do whatever I do and uh, when I was uh, into it big time I bought my cable in half mile rolls quarter mile rolls I got some underwater snares we need them got a few gloves we're just getting ready to go we might have to snare a few of those we got beaver that haven't uh, are two years old never seen a tree yet so sometimes we have to use a uh, rebar for our snares because uh, all they ever see here is uh, cattails and corn so we're signing off now till maybe next week and we'll do some beaver